Anyway, enough rambling. We're back on our Shinji Mikami marathon, playing some Killer7, and I, this is a weird, like, diverging point. So I looked up, uh, Shinji Mikami, he was the writer for this game, and he also was, like, a producer or something, but, uh, obviously the director is, um, I forget his name, but the guy that made No More Heroes and, like, all those fucking weird-ass games. I kinda, I've never, this is the first game of his that I've played. I might have to do another marathon, maybe after this one, where we play all the other games that he made, because, uh, this is cool. I really like this game. <laughs> He's also the guy that did Lollipop Chainsaw, right? I think. Okay, so we finished Chapter 1, Angel. Target 1, Sunset. Ooh. Yeah, I think... It's really cool that the blood splatters, like, go into, like, kanji. I can't fucking read that, because I don't know how to, but, um, it's cool all the same. <laughs> This game is insane in the best possible way. Ah. Suda51, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very much so. July like I said... I'm gonna be quiet while this reads off. All international disputes were resolved. Oh, cool. This day if only. The beginning of true peace for the entire world. For people of all races. The four powers... Even NASCAR. ...anti-terrorist organizations and set out creating peacekeeping agencies to bring order and security on a global scale. The world unified to do everything in its power to eradicate all the weeds of evil and disorder. I wasn't looking at the subtitles, I thought I said all the weebs. Under the motto of protecting the world from international terrorism, ideology terrorism, and cyber terrorism, stopped all air transportation, and closed every network station in a short span of two years to reduce the likelihood of terrorism. <laughs> the world had changed. War has changed. In the year 2000, are we watching an anime? A network of intercontinental expressways at two FPS. The Atlantic Ocean opened, connecting the two major sides of the world. In the following year of 2003. The construction of a mass scale distribution system began, and a man made landmass as large as a city was built over an ocean. The use and research of nuclear energy was banned, and all radioactive waste and materials were disposed of at an energy disposal facility in the Gibsoft Islands, a remote set of islands off the coast of the Indian These Ocean. These Gibsoft. Now, this is perfect. I could just drink while we watch the this. Elimination of the intercontinental <laughs> missiles that pose the biggest threat to world peace. I guess we're just watching the show now. In it's the rest of the game. <laughs> these weapons of mass destruction, they were launched outside the Earth's atmosphere and intercepted by other missiles, exploding them on contact. People around the world watch these explosions light up the sky. <laughs> as if they were some kind of dazzling light show. These explosions, later known as the missile shows, became the symbol of world peace. The world was filled with hope. It's the weirdest fucking the thing I've ever was on the rise. <laughs> seen in a video game, I think. At the signing ceremony of the UN's World Security Treaty in the year 2003, Surely nothing will go wrong from here. ...a of terrorists who called themselves Smiling faces attack the ceremony. Ten thousand percent. The devastating attack caught the ghosts in the show. <laughs> laughing man shit. And temporarily crippled key operations in the United Nations. Mm. Never heard of that. Assault was aimed at nothing. Hillary is dead. That's the game I was talking about yesterday. To create terror. Sorry, I'm like talking over everything. Oh, he worked in a failed frame game. Wildfire. Cool. There was nothing the police know that. Or military could do to counter the smiling faces. The only ones who had any chance of stopping these smiling. I've never played a Fatal Frame game, actually. <laughs> it's a side note. Professional I got Fatal Frame Three right here, though. The key players behind the well, scenes of the four not here, but nearby. Their oh wait, no. And called upon the group known as. Uh, eh, somewhere down here. <laughs> Killer Seven. Their only hope rested with them. It's pretty cool. <laughs> cool little uh, dynamic or thing there. Hello, Mrs. Smith. Mm. The election is drawing near. Have you decided on your vote? If you haven't, please let the Republic Party make the most of your precious vote. Thank you and have a nice day. 
God, I fucking hate text messages like that. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> when you get, like, unprompted texts of, like, Hey, so-and-so is trying to do this to democracy. Please vote for blah 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 Like, don't get me wrong, I vote. But, <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> Yeah, this game is like I said it yesterday. This game's oozing fucking style. It's great. Stop. He's he's, he's already dead. There's a lot to unpack here. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna absorb all the meaning of stuff on my first playthrough here. What? That was a stock sound eat? effect. <laughs> you wanna eat? Fast, okay. To go to class at nine. Fuck. I can't even talk to them. I can't even shoot my gun either. <laughs> Alright then. Same thanks. Are we playing Silent Hill 4 The Room? I probably need to go back in there. Yeah, like I said, I, I'm very un- I'm unfortunately very unfamiliar. Um... But, uh... Okay, my ability button's not doing anything. There's a big... Lockpick over there. Maybe I gotta change to lockpick, man. Oh! How long has it been? Or play as Harmon. That would make sense too. But I have, I have seen someone play No More Heroes one. Most of it. As you wish, Master. There's an important message for you. And I definitely see like this. A, like that game's also very stylish, but in a very different way, which is cool. Contact you. If there are visitors for me, call. As you wish. Samantha, the lights. As you wish, Master. <sighs> it's time. Can I go now? Yeah. Thanks. See you tomorrow, then. Thanks. Mwah. <laughs> I like it. Hmm. Yeah, I've mostly spoiled myself. I, I saw, or for No More Heroes, that is. I, I watched the person stream it up to like they were at the final boss and i had to go do some chores so like i i caught the part where they like fast forwarded things which is fucking hilarious <laughs> um but i missed everything past that i oh, can go outside now oh yeah <laughs> it's 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 delightfully self-aware in a way that's not annoying it's like um deadpool like I'm not here blowing any superhero movies, but it I've I've, en I've enjoyed both of the Deadpool movies and it it's really easy to like go too far when you make something that's self-aware where it's like annoying, but uh I think those, especially the first one, was a pretty good job at like not going too far. Look at this. <laughs> as does no more heroes, it seems. What is this? A bug in the system? No, sir. It's reading right. There's That's no Steve Bloom. What? That's hell? fucking Steve Bloom. <laughs> country could disappear off the we map. found him. Do you have the He's in every video game. Yes, sir. It's Japan. What? Are the fireworks ready? No, forget it. Japan is our ally. No, we're not authorized to make that kind of decision. Forget That's also a guy. That's the guy from uh, Dead Rising. Um, else. shit. Can't just let not happen. Frank West, but the other guy. The president on the line. Uh, the guy that plays Brad. I don't know the voice actor's name. This is an emergency call for the president. Mr. President, this is Spencer speaking, sir. 200 pulsars have been fired towards Japan. We're unable to compute their trajectory since we're avoiding the computation time lag. 
Interception can only commence two hours before initial impact. Shall we launch the fireworks? Mr. President, <laughs> your Mr. <assessment>, President. <laughs> They just raised the stakes 10,000% in this game. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, this one town is like fucked. We're taking out this building full of like terrorists. Okay, now there's just fucking a barrage of missiles coming at Japan, apparently. <laughs> and the US is trying to figure it out. <laughs> That's very fun. <laughs> I like Travis's character in No More Heroes because he's like, he's like an otaku, but he's not like the standard thing you'd expect from that. It creates this weird disconnect as you're playing through the game. Where are they headed? Japan. Washington. Uh, restaurant Fukushima. It's a popular joint. And the target? Uh, the owner of the place, Toru Fukushima. See, he's the middleman between the Japanese UN representatives and our government. A government job? Uh, it's a job from all the parties. Japan has turned against us. So that's why they're gonna hit Japan? Well, it's a possibility. It depends on how they move. Why is there a cutout on that bridge? Right. Am I about to throw this man off the bridge? It's up to the president. They have 18 hours. All hell is going to break loose over in Washington. And I sure as hell don't want to be there. That guy also sounds familiar. If for some reason you need help, go see a guy named Kasai. He's well informed, especially about the Japanese movement. You got all the details in there, okay? This time, the string puller is Fukushima. Now, the integrity and the true worth of Japan is at stake here. But I might just I might just be like hearing things in voice actors now. So I just recognize two of them. <laughs> that was the one guy was definitely Steve Bloom though, and I'm pretty sure the other guy was Brad. The guy that voices Brad in Dead Rising. <laughs> in that like war room that we saw a second ago. Alright, we got him. Here's your Warzu again. I feel like I should talk to him, but also I'm very slow at this game, so if I can just skip anything that he says to me, it would probably be for the best. Oh, but this guy. This guy's fast, I like it. I gotta reload every time! Oh shit! Don't laugh at me. I wonder if I can switch back. I cannot. Okay. Rock. Oh my god. Welcome. How many in your party, sir? <laughs> I want to talk to the owner. May I ask what it's concerning? Yeah, I'm here to kill Mr. Fukushima. <laughs> Certainly, we'll be delighted to serve you. <laughs> this fucking game, man. Yeah, I probably should level everyone up since it seems to be forcing me to do different characters at certain times. <laughs> You're alive still! God damn it, dude. Please be dead. Okay, he's dead. Is he dead? He's dead. <laughs> Ooh, that was tough. I keep forgetting I have a lock-on button. I should probably use that. Another guy. 
All you need is blood. It's like that Beatles song. All you need is blood. Blood. <laughs> Travis, what you got for me? What kind of cool t-shirts you got? No! No, 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 no! I fucking clicked off of everything. Mind if I tell you straight up? Hair through the grapevine. Chief, you're not the only one after this owner of this joint. Japan is controlled by the United Nations Party. He's number one, by the way. The UN Party goes down. Japan's minority party will take control. In other words, the Liberal Party would take the reins. <laughs> okay, Kono, what the fuck? There's some nasty shit cooking in this restaurant. And it ain't Mama's Fried Chicken. The thief from South America could climb this in a jiffy. Okay, so that's what's his name, right? Hold on, I gotta tab out because I tabbed out of my Twitch chat as well. Okay, there we go. Fixed <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, fuck! No! Oh, God, turn around, please. Yeah, I'm fucking. <laughs> I got got. There's another one, too. Come on, man! Am I dead? Not dead. I think a spawn guy is in behind me. Alright, carry a pigeon. What do you got for me? Dear Earmir, there's this is a warning, Earmir. Uh, transfer $100 to my account. I'm absorbing a $25 loss. Final offer, alright? Nothing terrible has happened yet. It's time for you to send the money. Uh, Consider it a gift from me to you. Surprisingly, the Smith Syndicate has many talents. And I ain't talking about cheap tricks like swallowing goldfish or cramming your head into a rubber glove. Uh, they're on a whole other plane. I saw with my own eyes. Heroes are for our age. Heroes are for our age. Uh, <laughs> Dan Smith is straight out of Japan anime. Launching balls of light and shit. Uh, yeah, you bet you blew my... You bet it blew my socks off. Hell, if I wanted to shake his head and ask for... Uh, heck, I wanted to shake his head and ask for an autograph. But I decided to put my life first. Kaede Smith spurts blood from her arms. What a sick sight. And then what did she do? She flattened a wall right before my eyes. She must have taken out some kind of barrier. That's what Kaede blood, Kaede's blood can do. Sometimes her arm sucks blood. Uh, that's some stuff I didn't expect to see either. Master Smith is still a mystery. But I know that he can do some sweet wrestling moves. <laughs> Got the luchador mask, okay. It's us. Uh, he was a small town pro wrestler who drew crowds in main events, but he, just before he made his debut... In the New York scene, he mysteriously disappeared. This is common knowledge among fans. <laughs> the only thing for sure is that there's more that meets the eye. Uh, an update will follow. Johnny Gagnon. <clears throat> kind of a neat way to, like, deliver information. <laughs> Don't fucking spawn right in fucking front of me, you bitch. I think there's a guy behind me, too. Can I just leave? Should I just leave? I missed his leg. Shit. This game is pretty cool. But I get the feeling I only have, like, this guy and nothing else. Because we, we changed to him, like... <laughs> You're not dead! I hit you in your fucking weak spot! This is bullshit. Come on. Alright, we're very low health. Can I heal? I don't have any healing. <laughs> oh, shit. God, this guy's kind of rough to work with here. There's our man. Maybe I'm missing his, like, spot or whatever. I'm not sure. Hallway or hallway? We're going this way this time. Hey, Travis, what's up, man? Full brain this evening is like, 
my damn tears, you hear me? Blood red flower is gonna go up. Like a firework. And it's up to uh, prevent from hitting and killing everybody. So, Chief, which side are you on? Homeland or Japan? He has his shirt says carnival. Kill the owner. Japan goes down the toilet. You are right with that man? Be careful of the new enemy type. Thanks. Thanks, video game. <laughs> Sounds like Mark Hamill Joker. Yeah, it kind of does, yeah. It's definitely not Mark Hamill voicing that, but I see what you mean. Bomb shed, sm bomb head smile. What? Bullshit. Alright, we got him. You know, I wouldn't I wouldn't object to a uh, Harmon room right about now. Fucking hell. No, oh, I missed. I'm dead. <laughs> That's funny. Won't come out for four years. Well played, Suda. Thank God I can play as somebody else. Okay, Dan is the most leveled up. So, let's play him. Dan Smith. I feel like that was just waiting for me to die, basically. <laughs> just kept throwing more shit at me. I just realized there was like some stuff we didn't unlock in the level before. Maybe we come back to that level? I don't know. Oh, we're right at the entrance, okay. Cool. We gotta go revive our man. <laughs> 2032, yeah. So we'll get the next No More Heroes. So wait, he worked on all the, like, did he work on the spinoff as well? I'm not sure if I fully read everything you typed there. I gotta say, also, like, so, you know, producers, whatever, like, it, it's a role. You do stuff as a producer, but, like, it seems really weird, like, hey, Shinji Mikami, come write the, you just wrote Resident Evil 4, I'm, I'm Put things into perspective here. You just wrote Resident Evil 4, right? Wrote, directed, etc. Uh, write this game. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> like, like seriously, what the fuck? <clears throat> oh, he directed all of them. Cool. Okay. <laughs> Grab the bag. Oh fuck! Run back. <laughs> I hope they don't come from other directions. Okay, they don't. Oh, that's easy. Easy win. How do I pick this up? To clear the room or something? Be dead forever? What's the dealio? Hello? Before, I just walked up to them and it did it. Um... Maybe that's just not the case for this mission. I don't know. Whatever. He's 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 easily the worst hero <laughs> or hero uh assassin, so he's just dead, that's fine. Oh there's my Oh thank you! Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> it might be. I didn't realize that was like how that worked. I don't have any blood, come on. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, uh... How do I know if my inventory is full? <laughs> Blood empty. Oh, that's just a guess, gotcha. Oh yeah, right, you haven't played this game. <laughs> um, I don't know. Iwarzu, help me revive this man. Oof. Oh, maybe I need blood to revive them. I don't have any right now. That would actually make sense.
Well, better not die because there's no blood in this level. <laughs> That's probably because I'm not hitting them in their spots or whatever. Damn. Oh shit! Okay, I can use that strategically. Cool. Dude, I am super digging this game. It's very fun. I can't tell you how happy I am that I actually finished Mario, Dr. Mario. Wait, that, that was blood, right? Give me some blood. Yeah! There's a lot of dudes out here. Visually, these guys remind me of Regenerators, and I know that, like, Shinji Mikami's involvement is probably fairly low compared to the other games I've played so far in this marathon. <laughs> Aside from maybe Aladdin, like he barely had anything to do with Aladdin as well, but I just really wanted to play that. <laughs> Bloody hell. I think he was just a producer on Aladdin. He did- he did direct the Go Goof Troop, though. <laughs> it's a damn fine game. <laughs> yeah. Got him. Everybody dies. Anyone in chat ever seen the movie, uh, Murder Party? I love that movie. Okay, we can't revive that guy still. We're gonna go forward. Whatever. I thought I had blood now, so we're fine, but I guess not. Honestly, that's probably that director's, like, worst movie. No, it's not. Uh, Hold the Dark, or whatever that movie's called. This is his worst movie. <laughs> but that guy makes good movies. Jeremy Sal Salnier? No, wait, no, that's the actor in his movies, usually. I think. I'm not sure. Someone fact check me. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. See, I feel like I can do a pretty decent Wario voice when I'm just saying things that Wario says, but if I'm trying to, like, read a line in Wario's voice, it does not work as well. Going back to Dr. Mario for a sec. No. Don't kill me. Where are you at? Who did that? <laughs> there he is. Oh shit, another one. It is actually too easy. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the guest room first before we go downstairs. Oh shit. Oh, never mind. I'm a god. Face. Flowers can be heard groaning. Same, thanks. <laughs> what the f Who is still here? <laughs> Where? Where are you? I'm gonna find out when it's too late, aren't I? Probably. The cherry blossoms won't be blooming this year. Rip. Alright. Mr. Smith. I saw information, yes? Vase is important. Ah, the flower must bloom. Think of a way to make it happen. Shoot the mass to hear more. I'm not giving you my fucking blood. Yeah, no. Screw that. I'll take your tip, but I'm not gonna get the explanation. Ah, there he is. Please tell me I can shoot through this. Okay, good. There's another one. Fuck it, we're just leaving. Fuck it. Get out of here. Probably could definitely stand to get some more blood, but whatever. <laughs> I like that you can't talk to whoever that person is every time you come in here. Give me blood. Oh, maybe I needed to synthesize it into serum to actually be able to 
Work with what's his name, you know? You wanna die, huh? God damn, just calm down. Dan? I don't wanna die. Okay? <laughs> Look, I'm a cleaner. I can feel no remorse from seeing a dead body. To me, it's merely cold. I can level him up even though he's dead. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Don't make me feel. Don't make me You wanna like? Okay? 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 Look, I'm a cleaner. Okay. What? I feel like I should probably level up like everyone's just base stats at least once. You wanna die? Not what? <laughs> Well, no, hold on. Okay. Where's the fast guy? Yeah, that's good. Ooh. Oh, we leveled up a bunch already. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right, I'm gonna keep two serums on me just to see if that will let me like revive the guy if I ever go back to that area. Um. But for now, we're moving forward. Oh wait, no, we're in this room again. <laughs> Not moving forward at all. Take the stairs, damn it! Oh, that's an insta kill. Oh, fuck me. Okay. All right, speedy guy. Let's go. Hopefully, I can revive this guy. Don't make me say it again. Look. What? Okay. Brutal, man. They got me. They got me good. <laughs> Dude, I can't revive him. What the fuck is up with this shit, man? Fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Okay, so that gives you more blood when you do that. What the hell? Get blood. Okay. Fifty six deliters of blood. Dude, come on. Hey Travis, what's up, man? Then our Fukushima is mixed up in all sorts of things. Power lunch. <laughs> Even the International Ethics Committee is getting involved. Chief. You watch yourself. The ethics agents, or hyenas, are a motley crew of rejects. The assassins trained in the core. Now those guys are real. After the re after the Yakumo party, cabinet policy. Or the Yakumo for short. Just a bunch of paper, but it can change the world. UN party, my friend. When did this game turn into Metal Gear Solid? What the fuck? Ooh, okay, we need we need a big ol' C to get in there. But perhaps this hallway will take us somewhere. <laughs> take us to Bomb Man Land. Fucking IK Asshole Man Land. Go! <laughs> All right then. <laughs> All right, let's get more serum. Maybe I don't have enough to revive. I don't know how much I need. 
But that's not a lot. Okay. Can I, like... Hold on. Tell me about blood absorption a little bit here. Please say something useful, not just bullshit. That blood, there's no tomorrow. <coughs> Personas can absorb blood out of the enemy. Next is a stabilizer to help multiple personas. Without blood, your life is in your very life is in danger. Okay. A start slash pause. To check the blood volume. Okay. You must use blood wisely. It didn't really tell me what I needed to know. Maybe there's not maybe there's another topic though on uh Personalities, maybe? Remnant Psyches. I'm gonna think maybe that's the, like, revival, uh, tactic or something. Hatred abounds. <coughs> Transparent bodies that haunt you are Remnant Psyches. Okay, no, these are- those are just people we're talking to. They refuse to let go of their attachment to this world. Why is this happening, you ask? You should know why, Master. Because you killed them! But then... There are those who would rather be dead, and so thank you! <laughs> like myself. Okay. What about about multiple personalities? Maybe that'll tell me how to revive them? I don't know. I feel like that's gotta be in this menu somewhere, right? This is telling me how to play the game. Master, members of the Syndicate are under your command. They're not simple multiple personalities. They're perfect research subject. Multiple personalities, but with multiple bodies. Your very own monopolized field. However, Garcian cannot change personality at will. He must use the TV. And watch for the security camera. The name of Harmon, okay. Got lore explanations of why we're changing stuff, that's cool. I just want to know how to fucking play the game, though, you know? Oh, recovery, here we go. <laughs> you gotta watch your damage. Uh, no, this is about healing yourself, damn it. It's, it's gotta be in this menu somewhere, though. Like, maybe one of the other topics on this tab. Blood's at the bottom. Press the A button to revive Vigor. Okay. So that does use up blood, but that's how you heal yourself. Use the blood in the test tubes. And the IBM's to close your persona's in a tight spot. I got that much already. No, 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 okay. The test tubes are your healing items. Body retrieval. Okay, here we go. A real tight spot. <clears throat> Their bombs are absolutely deadly. They'd even take out our personas. Persona dies. Leave it to Garcon. He may be a big oaf. Fuck you, game. <laughs> He's a master cleaner. I guess it's a job fit for everyone. Oh, and don't forget. Wait a second! After he cleans up, reanimate the persona from the bag. Okay, yeah. Um. Garcon is not some code name for me. That's the guy with the briefcase. Holy shit, I'm fucking dense. Alright. <laughs> don't make me say it again. I'm a cleaner. I'm a cleaner. <laughs> Alright, let's go get Dan back. I guess we can get the other guy back, but I don't think I need to, necessarily. <laughs> Got him. Look, I'm a clean. 
cleaner. I can feel no remorse from seeing a dead body. It's nothing at all to do with like health or anything like that. That's just that guy's ability. Don't make me say it again. If he dies, we're in deep shit though. I, I take it, right? <laughs> So let's be careful. You've got blood. <coughs> nice respawn enemies there. We got him. Sweet. <laughs> Back to Dan. Look, I'm a cleaner. I can no, don't charge shot. Resurrect him. Body. To me, it's merely cold, rotting flesh. Why is this guy so hard to revive? God damn it. Woo. Lovely up while we're at it. Cause why the hell not? I feel like I should probably level up uh, the cleaner guy. Uh, well, there's no like health upgrade. Cause that's that's the thing I would think about, right? Like, it's making sure that he's very healthy. Oh, oh, oh! He doesn't even have any leveling up he can do. Okay, moving on. <laughs> uh, so we explored that area to its full extent. Um. Maybe I gotta pay that asshole and just figure out, like, what the hell to do. No, don't go that way! Just trying to get some distance between me and the enemy. Shit. Okay, that's bullshit. This is too easy. God damn it, dude. It's in the way. This fucking guy. You know what? Maybe, maybe I just wimp out and take the mask. Fuck it. Tell me what to do. Your game is too cryptic for me. For my dumb brain. Yeah. It's middle fingers to you too, friend. <laughs> Welcome, my little loser. I don't see you going place. <laughs> so I am the true mask. Oh, this fucking game, man. I shall guide you. Ring of water and the vase. Okay, so there's a ring of water somewhere. Your mother would not be proud. <laughs> Tomorrow it could be you. Great. I don't know where that ring of water might be. However, there was a split path that we ignored in the very beginning, so maybe I gotta go back there. Simple as that. So we're going that way. If I had something to get that tree out of my way, uh, we could go the other direction in the garden over this way, but there's no other there's no other like unexplored path that we have at this particular time, so clearly we just need a water ring. And then we equip that. Simple as that. Wait, what was in here? This is just a Harmon room, right? Yeah. But it is a save point, so I guess I'll take it. We haven't really discovered anything, but we've provided everyone, so <laughs> let's uh let's do that. I think this game repeats itself a lot because it's well, one, it's like a very like weird game. 
But also beyond that, it's also like, uh... You could ignore the advice, as I have, <laughs> in several spots. So it wants to make sure you get it down. Ooh, that was close. So shooting those weak spots, I think, gives you... It's more so for getting blood than it is for, like, killing them faster or anything like that. If I'm, if I'm, if I'm interpreting this right, I might be wrong, I don't know. I mean, you know, give me blood, bitch. Okay, we already went that way. Maybe I missed something over there, but I, I also didn't go... There's like a path out here that I didn't go, so let's try that out first. Yeah, this hallway down this way. That was just a Harmon room. Shoot. Okay, uh, I guess we're gonna go back into that other area then, because I don't know where else I'd find a water ring. And as the mask says... Wait, was there anything out here that that can do? No, it was just a straight shot between here and there. Okay. It's fine. Whatever. <laughs> I think that just means there's gotta be something in the waiting room I missed. Oh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, blood. Oh, okay, so it does work. It's it's also an instant kill. Gotcha. I don't know what I'm looking at here. This could be. Wait, what did Travis say? Maybe there's like a character I need to come over here with. Oh this, yeah, you know he was just talking about that. There's other people on the job. Gotcha. Oh, they've respawned. <laughs> I guess, like, you can get, like, a sloppy hit and get some blood. That's where my confusion's coming from. Map also gives me hits? Where to map at? That's where we are. Wait. I didn't mean to close it like that. Yep. Oh! Okay, we can use what's your- Okay, ah, I got it now. Cool. It does. The irony is that, like, I'm pretty sure this guy is not voiced by uh, Steve Bloom, but there is a guy voiced by Steve Bloom who did Spike Spiegel in the American Cowboy Bebop in this game. He's just in, like, the, the U.S., like, war room. Okay, so we need to change to what's-her-name there. And I guess also a masked dude is in the guest room where we got that carrier pigeon. He can do something there. I'm not sure what. I don't remember there being, like, a an issue there. Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, so just go back. Uh, what's her name can just break that tree down or something, or interact with it in some way, so we'll... We'll go back there and switch to her. Uh-oh, shit. <laughs> I'm panicking. <clears throat> Give me that thin blood. I... I'm a dumbass. Ah, I missed. Hey, we got him. It's a shame I couldn't get the controller working for this game. I feel like this port maybe isn't, like, the greatest, but that's literally all I- the only, like, problems I have with this game so far are, like, the port doesn't really explain how to use control as well, but the game itself is really fucking good. I did not hit the right button. <laughs> I don't even know if Capcom published this, though. This is, uh, like, studio whatever, or, it's, uh... <laughs> shit. Oh, shit, the eggs are coming out. 
Suda 51, I mean, or whatever the hell. There's a guy closer to me, isn't there? What the? What was that sound effect? It does sound a lot like that, though. In DMC. Right. Capcom's certainly no stranger to uh, using. Oh, yeah, I have a scope on this thing. I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> Oh, and I can't hit that from here. Nice. Oh god, the sensitivity. What? Oh, they were the publisher. Okay. There we go. Thanks. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Run! <laughs> I thought you were dead. God, this guy, <laughs> he won't die. Alright, maybe I gotta use my skill or something. Either that, or I just totally, like, saw the wrong face there. I don't know. Ah. There we go. That'll do it. I guess that hint was there when, uh, what's-his-name said that, like, oh, she can even destroy- the carrier pigeon note had a thing about her destroying barriers. Alright. Back to Dan. Just farm blood at these things. <laughs> oh fuck, one of them got out. Dude, I can't see. Yet I somehow hit his weak spot anyway. Alright. Slick. Travis, give me a ring right now. Good shape. Smith, have a minute to spare? It could open your eyes. Japan doesn't have its own defense system. Its survival is contingent on the United States. As far as the homeland is concerned, Japan has extra baggage. Oh no. Its usefulness as an ally is long past. Oh god. Straight up, it ain't worth saving, you see? That's reality for you. So, Chief, you still gonna do it? You know what is meant by fireworks? They're missiles. The explosion that occurs when missiles collide. Well, that sure is a beautiful sight indeed. But you only see it if the defense system is activated. Unhelpful. Damn it. Okay, I think the other room where What's-His-Name is uh, doing stuff. Probably where we need to go then. Yeah, so we gotta use the water ring there, but if I go back to the guest room, this guy is here near where that carrier pigeon was. Oh wait, there's like... No, no, that's the Harmon room. Okay. This is where the staircase was. Okay, cool. Yeah, we didn't have him then, so that's... Oh, shoot! <clears throat> I totally misinterpreted the waiting room. I thought, oh, that's where I am. But no, it's telling me, use that guy there. Okay, so we need the lockpick dude there. I guess I'll go back to that first, and then we'll go check out the thing that the luchador dude can do. Eventually I'll learn their names, but uh, I know this guy's Dan. <laughs> Got that much down. But you guys can't see my mouse. Huh. <laughs> Whatever. Probably looks better visually anyway. Wait. Uh, yeah, that's right. Coyote. Oh yeah, the mask. Wait, no, I, I went too far. <laughs> Lobby, and then I go down hallway over here. Instead of other hallway. Because it takes me to the guest rooms. Err, no. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I gotta go back through this hallway. The courtyard. Sweet. <laughs> Speaking of too easy, uh, I did see one comment when I, I was looking up like, should I play this game with a controller? I literally googled that before I played this because I don't know anything about the game. And uh, it was like a Reddit post. Someone was like, oh yeah, you, you probably should play it with a controller for like a proper experience because the mouse makes it a little too easy. Sorry, I couldn't get my controller working. And I don't own this for GameCube, so... <laughs> Rip. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'm sure I will suck enough to uh, 
make up for that. I'm still really enjoying it regardless. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I could definitely, like, I totally understand, like, because it's mostly, as far as, like, the challenge goes, it's mostly around, uh, you know, aiming and stuff, and this game was designed for a controller, so it's a little easy when you have, uh, <laughs> you know. Just direct mouse aim. Eagle has landed on the roof. Oh, shoot. I guess I did level Coyote up a little bit, so... I probably would have been fine to keep playing as him. It's a good old jump. Yes, indeed. Yeah, because, like, honestly... Like, a couple things have been a little obtuse, but at the same time, a lot of that's more the fault of the port than the actual game itself, because it's like, oh, press this button to do that. Like, it, it, it's laid everything out for me, but it doesn't tell me how to do it, because the things are all in... Oh, nice, another ring. Sweet. Well, hello. Smith, wave emoji. Raining today, is it? You know what? I never go to school when it rains. Well, my mom doesn't understand. Super mom with all her reasons. She says, go to school. So I jump from the si oh no. <laughs> That's a compound fracture, mind you. Pulverized into mush. Splat, absolutely foobard. Took six months to heal. I got to take half year off from school. <laughs> Whoopee! <laughs> Joy emoji. <laughs> you forgot this, didn't you? I haven't quite pieced together who she is yet, but... Uh, a single classmate came to visit me in the hospital. Mom? What about her? Of course she didn't come. Happy emoji. She jumped with me. And I landed on top of her. Like, the coolest thing, you know? I'll leave the rest to your imagination. That's just fucking dark as shit. The imagination of a killer. Neither has she. Oh, okay, so that's supposed to be vague. Good to know. <laughs> it didn't even fully close, she's still there. Alright, let's equip that ice water ring. Help. Oh. There we go. Okay, so on my way to the other thing, I think is where that thing I need to use the water ring on is, so... Morbid joke indeed. You know what's crazy? Uh, if anyone here has ever watched the show The Wire... Oh shit, he's back. I'm gonna get hit. 100%. Where are you? Oh! <laughs> Damn it. I should've turned around. I got blood. We can, we can spare some, I think. Anyway. In the show The Wire, there's a scene where a character drops from, like, the fourth floor of, a, like, an apartment complex. And that show is based on, like, a real story. And, uh, the character that that character is based on, or, the, sorry, the, the real human being that that character is based on, uh... You know, it's just a bit unreal that you jump from, like, a fourth story floor, or fourth story of a apartment and, like, live. Uh... And that's... That's not what the real life character did. That guy jumped from the sixth floor in real life. <laughs> and they, they, they toned it down when they made the show. Oh, shit. And survived. I mean, he's dead current day, but... <laughs> Point is... Omar coming. This is too easy. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I haven't watched that show in a real long time. It's a good one, though. If you like crime dramas. Yeah, th th that show is based off of two different books. Um... Which were, like, written by the same guy. One of which he wrote by, like, trailing the Baltimore police for, like, a year of his life and, like, writing a book about it. And then the other one was, like, uh, interviewing, like, ex-crime people in the Baltimore area. Like, people that had kind of, like, reformed themselves and whatnot. 
and getting their input of like how how things were. Okay, we're in the room with the uh, vase. The staircase should be at the exit here. The stairs are where I need to use uh, the other guy, but the base, water ring howls. Hell yeah. Save that plant. We've done it. Cherry blossoms bloom fully. Nope. <laughs> I went backwards by mistake. Hey, we can get in that door now. Sweet. <laughs> this fucking guy. <laughs> Still just hit, sitting there with his birds out like that. Odd engraving. Still gotta use other guy in the room that's next to this room, though. Mask, uh, Smith. Ah, god damn it. It's like a blood farm right here. Oh my god, I suck. <laughs> it sucks so hard. I will say, this game would be completely broken if they let me adjust the sensitivity. <laughs> the fact that it's a little bit low is uh, making it just not insanely broken. Just like flick around to like wherever the guys are. Okay, we need mask smith. Also, I guess while we're at it, deposit our blood. Because why not? Level up a bit. We've got a lot of it. So it looks like thick blood is for leveling up and thin blood's for healing. So hitting those crits. Oh, I didn't mean to leave the whole TV. Don't make me say it again. You wanna die? Huh? How much is oh yeah, everything of his is like currently really expensive because I leveled up all I didn't I didn't level this up, I guess. Um Okay. <laughs> Judge. I'll take care of them. Alright, Mask Smith. Um I do want more power, because if, if he can't, like, if he can't one-shot whatever he's fighting, it's kind of a problem. <laughs> uh, hold on. Okay, waivers for target lock. I always forget to use that, because I'm a dumbass. Judge. Other way, well, I'll leave, I'll just save the rest of my serum for now. And we need him to do whatever this thing is. It's in this room, right? I think. Where are we? I'm actually really confused right now because I don't know, like... Oh, no, no, I need to... Oh, it's past this. It's over here by the statue, I think. But I don't remember there being, like, anything. Oh, you know what? I guess I could... Yeah, not here. But there was this room that was empty. Like, the one had Travis in it, the other one was empty, so maybe I go in here? Nope. Oh no, yeah, we're like... Oh, it's past this room! Oh, okay, okay, okay. That would make sense why I didn't think there was anything left. <laughs> No, not the bomb guys. Please. I'm way too close to the corner. Ooh, last second there. That guy in there. Good to go. Lock deactivated. Special room. What's so special about it? Where does this go? Oh, carrier pigeon. Nice. Some more lore. Let's see what's up. Continue my report. 
Kevin Smith never fails to amaze. <laughs> this is a movie review now. Uh, you won't believe this, but it's the straight up truth. The sucker is a real life invisible man. At first, I didn't believe it. It's gotta be a hoax, right? Well, shit, this guy's for real. And then Con Smith, what a pain in the ass punk. I can never catch him. It blew my socks off nine times. <laughs> I like that they keep using this like old man phrase of it blew my socks off. <laughs> Uh, when he speeds off, he disappears. That's right, disappears, and Olympic records mean nothing with him running around. Coyote Smith has a thing, a thing for being a crook. But it's not like the other thugs. He's fit, he jumps like an animal. Incredible athlete uh, uh, athleticism. Not to mention, he can pick any padlock. He must have picked this up as a method of survival in a rough neighborhood. And then there's Gar Garçon Smith. I really haven't seen him much. Uh, so everything I know is based on conjecture. Rumor is he can have he can spot heaven smile a mile away. This character is no joke. Going up against monsters like that. My investigation continues. Jar Johnny Gagnon. <coughs> Slowly getting calibrated to the world, and yet I still feel like I'm completely fucking lost. Oh man, no save point. All right. Well, give me a quick second, everybody. Sorry, I gotta go uh, take a quick break here. Enjoy the. Uh, the, no the non-music that's going on in here. But I'll be back in just a moment. I'll grab some water. All right, I'm back. Water. And more. Ooh. Yeah, so we're gonna need what's his name to get through here, but... Lumber is essential for training. <laughs> Go put the right button. I did not. <laughs> oh yeah, I did. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, of course, he's a wrestler. You needed him to suplex it. It's wonderful. Chef with a gun. What's in your right hand, Chico? Please don't. 
This is just a... Put your arms down. No, no, it's not like that. This gun is a... Don't move, amigo. Please, don't shoot. Stay still. Ow! And we're dead. <laughs> I love every cutscene. I want this game to just be cutscenes. It's fucking amazing. <laughs> what were you doing here? We're cleaning up. Our head chef always tells us that an ideal kitchen is a kitchen clean enough that you can lick the floor. Anyway, it's the least that I can do for them. The others, the chef, the waiters, where are they? Those guys with the strange smiles. You saw them. It's dangerous, Aki. Get out of here. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I love the little hee <laughs> Did I even need to go in there <laughs> to see that guy? <laughs> Seems like that didn't really do anything. I'm gonna ignore Warzu for now. And probably forever. Can I save in here? No, goddamn. Rude. I think there's been. There was like two save spots in this entire level so far, and they were both right next to each other. <laughs> another smile. Oh, another <laughs> smile. God damn. Lucky shot. Definitely a guy over there. He's fast. He's also fucking dead. Oh, he's not dead! Shit! Is there a guy behind me? Now we're good. Oh boy. It's a feng, sh feng shui map. <clears throat> uh, Alright, Yoon. What do you gotta say to us? Mr. Smith. Oh, he starts out the same way. Look closely at that sign. <clears throat> Big hint right in front of you. Carl Directions and the Mythical Beasts. Can't be apart, no. They must come together. Shoot the mass to hear more. No thank you. Yeah. Okay, tortoise is north, dragon is east, lion is west, and uh, bird is south. I don't know if I didn't identify those things properly or not. That's okay, though. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, don't we have to use what's-her-name for this? I think. Wrong button. <laughs> Number two, I think. Unless it's different this time, I don't know. Oh no, he just wants hearts, right? Okay. Oh no, he has one. Okay, uh... Hold on, I got a message here. No, do not... Don't return the title screen. It's been a long time since we saved. Alright, there we go. Um, we do need to figure that out. We're gonna need that guy's hollow blood shell or whatever. But 
it's different this time. Finally, I can save. <laughs> Thank God. Christ. <laughs> We're going back to Dan. Maybe going into each of these hallways would help a bit. North house, okay. That's where the turtle was. Oh, fuck the reload! Oh, the stomp! Alright. Cool with that. Travis, what do you guys say? Good luck. Straight up, he's desperate. Fukushima's only ace in the hole is the Yakumo. The secret conference of the US Japan territory talks held at. The Kaku building tomorrow represents the time limit. The Yakumo will determine whether the fireworks will launch. Fukushima's offering to the gods. What's your move, Chief? Kill him and sink Japan? Or let him live and get the Yakumo? The Yakumo is dangerous. It will allow the United States to rule the world. Of course, humankind is in your hands, Chief. Damn. Okay. We want the turtle. I guess it's the warrior? Yeah, that's the guy. Black warrior paper door shuts. Do I, do I leave it that way? Yeah, leave it that way. Or do we leave that one open? I don't know. I'm gonna assume I close that one and then we're good. <laughs> I totally do not. Also, one second here. Oh shit! This will be east. East was the ti no. East was not the tiger. Oh, carry pigeons over here. God damn. My dearest Ermir, the world is falling to chaos, and all those ruled by a deep darkness increase in number. There's only one group they fear. Have you heard of the Harmon Assassins? I don't want to call them on you. Consider setting up a payment plan. <laughs> Found a target of their first job. His name is Travis Bell. He disappeared 30 years ago. It's no mistake that he was murdered. People remember him, and nobody... Few people remember him, and nobody has said they were with him. It seems he got himself into some dangerous business. I will follow the murderous trail, no doubt, a bottomless pit. Uh, I can't stop shaking, but I will put my life on the line and find out. I'll be contacting you again. Hmm. <laughs> Probably aim for his weak spots, but whatever, man. That works too. <clears throat> okay, so. Yeah, the dragon was to the east. And then the tiger was to the west, and the uh, bird was to the south, so. Hopefully, I got that right. Sorry, I still got another message here. The guy coming up behind me, I see him. <laughs> Gonna get your arm, bitch. Dude, I can't aim. What's wrong with me? Oh, shit. Okay, south room. Let's go. This is the bird. <laughs> Aw, oh, man, I missed. Ooh. 
Phoenix. Perfect. I really hope I'm doing this right. <laughs> I didn't need to do it the other way around where I closed the or I opened the ones that are Dude, he's right behind me! <laughs> oh god. At least we got his arm. Even if, it, even if it didn't kill him, which means I probably like missed slightly or something. I don't know. Okay, I did not go in the west room, which is the uh... <laughs> shit. Fucking great. <laughs> Thanks. I ran straight into that. That was my bed. Tiger. Do -do 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 -do. Have I done it? Uh, I'll just check with this guy. I have this feeling that I've seen the sushi chef before. I recognize that I'm full of myself and my manliness. <laughs> Look, it's all a charade, I tell you. A phony. All looks and nothing more. I don't care what you say, master. That is one man I cannot accept. And no, it's not because he's more handsome than me. <laughs> Nothing of the sort. Never. I just cannot forgive the rat. In the name of Harmon. Alright. <laughs> We did it. As as usual, that guy has nothing relative to say at all. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> behind me? No, he's right there. This is too easy. Finally, my aim's back on on track here. Uh, okay. They said someone was like invisible or whatever. Maybe we gotta use that guy. Wasn't the con? I guess I could try to do this, right? I don't think it was the masked guy either. Mr. Invisible, yeah. <laughs> Invisible Smith. This guy, maybe? He's very fast. Dangerous. I'm dangerous. Damn it. <laughs> Wasn't fast enough. Wait, the bridge is down. Maybe if I go the other way now. Dude, he's so fast right now. <laughs> Ridiculous. We can sneak up behind him or something. Oh. If only I could retain basic knowledge of the game. Nature is monk of speed. <laughs> Kind of does. Even when he's just walking at normal speed, he's kind of like that. Uh, okay, let's try another one. Who else we got? It was not the girl. I don't think it was the con guy. So that's five. I think six is the luchador or mask smith. The more I say their names, the more I'll remember them. <laughs> yeah, six is Mask Smith, and seven... Oh, seven doesn't work. Uh... But there's seven of them. Wait. Shoot. Hold on, that's four... Wait. Con Smith is four. <laughs> uh... Speed... We'll call him Speed Smith. I, you know, I didn't try using my special on this guy, but he just does, like, multi-shot or whatever, so... I don't think Dan is the answer, either. Mm. 
Oh, the knife guy. Oh, yeah. Maybe he's the one that goes invisible. Ah, here we go. Is this it? No, he still saw us anyway. Damn it. Bullet. Oh, yeah, the bullet. Oh, so we still got this little shell. Cool. I don't know if that just wasted all of my blood, but that's fine. It's worth it to figure this shit out, you know? Last time I needed two, though. I might need two again. The Vinculum Gate? Let me take those. Yes! We got enough. He didn't say go away. Yes, I'll receive. Go right on inside. God, this game's fun. You know, it's definitely something to be said of a game that's, like, unique and fun. And this game certainly is unique. But it's also pretty damn fun. IMO. Hey, it's that guy again. <laughs> Can't stand it anymore. Wish they put it on weed. That would be dope. I've seen enough nightmares. I won't believe anybody. The next monster. It's super huge in a certain part. I can't recall. Uh oh, what part? I can't remember which part. You mustn't shoot it. You must not shoot that part. <laughs> Just kidding. Don't shoot his wiener. That would have been cool if they had done that. Back in the day. Or both. Phantom smile. So I don't know if I am supposed to shoot this or not shoot it. It sounds like I'm supposed to shoot it. This is too easy. <laughs> I don't know though. Okay. Let me let me counter counter that statement, girl Chen. Uh red steel. <laughs> Enough said. I have never played any of Suda51's games, so the reason I'm playing this is because uh, I'm trying to play all the games that Shinji Mikami had a major hand in, and he, he wrote this game, I guess. <laughs> or, not I guess, it's true. Uh, I've seen the first No More Heroes played. One day I want to go back and play other the other Suda51 games. I remember, I'm scared, I'm very scared. It's a bloodbath. She's a strong girl. Maybe that'll be our next marathon. You gotta keep shooting or you'll lose. You must keep shooting. <clears throat> I've seen like a very small amount of footage of uh, Lollipop Chainsaw and I've also seen most of the first No More Heroes. Just from like watching a streamer play it. Oh, here we go again. We're harming. But who are we harming? It's funny I mentioned that, cuz... I have never played Red Steel 2. I've heard that that's actually good. I bought Red Steel with my Wii. That was like the first console I like saved up to buy. That I didn't just get as like a present. <laughs> as a child. I love the Wii. But fuck me. Red Steel is a horrible purchase. <laughs> That's good. That's good. I should probably play that one day. I don't know. I was like, man, I wasted all the money I saved up for this game. <laughs> and I'm stuck with it now, because that was all I could afford after buying the Wii. <laughs> I always wanted to be a team master. What is uh, one of the reasons I chose this that puzzle push. game on the Wii? Zack and Wiki, I think? That's a really good game that uses motion controls. But I love puzzle games, so... May that be. Ignore the last, like, two hours ago when I was swearing constantly at a puzzle game. You're an interesting man, <laughs> and you ask a very difficult question. Perhaps it's a sense of humor that can only come from someone who lives his life on the edge. I wanted to become a politician who could be a true leader, but the world of politics was like... That's why I didn't buy the second one, so that's fair. I acted. They were merely actors playing the politician. <clears throat> Did you ever think of oh, being nice. an actor? 
Well, I like that the switch port lets you turn motion controls off if you don't want to have them. Asking me if I wanted to become an architect for them. Architect. I'd probably play them with them on anyway, but to design and devise. Yes. I took the offer with delight. Is that the only thing you do, Mr. Fukushima, the founder? Armin's so intense. <laughs> oh, we're gonna fight her. Could you bring us some refreshments? Hundred <clears> percent. <throat> Julia Kisugi. She's definitely the boss here. We drinking out of the same bowl? It's a really old story. Union 7, a group made up of seven young men, drew up the Yakumo Party cabinet policy. The heat of factional politics eventually broke down the Union 7. This is some weird reference to the like Seven the Samurai or something. The world of politics. I haven't ever seen that it movie though, so I don't know. To me then. <laughs> this country didn't have what it took to compete with the rest of the world. It must be wonderful to have such a bright secretary. Not as bright as you, Mr. Smith. Oh, he did. Hand over the Yakumo. <clears throat> Lady, where are your manners? <laughs> I knew it. I'm gonna get her. This game just went nutty in like the best fucking way. <laughs> Super approve of what's going on. Every turn here. <laughs> I guess to be fair they did say like, the enemy ahead, keep shooting her, so it's kind of... <laughs> kind of gives it away. <laughs> hey, Travis. What are you up to? She's a hottie, ain't she? What a waste, though. The last fruitless attempt at resistance by the Liberal Party. Broad ban. Using a woman as a weapon? That doesn't bode well for them. It's the kind of thing only an inept party would resort to. <laughs> Japanese politicians are rotten to the core. Smith, there's no sex discrimination here. Don't hesitate. Take her out like the rest of them. Can I? Yeah! <laughs> I need to level up uh, my other guys a little bit more. Actually, wait. I have a ton of blood I have not used. Hold on. Let's go back to the room. <laughs> and instead of leveling up the other characters, I'm going to spend this on Dan. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Just one more level of power for Dan. Then we'll, then we'll spend some blood on other people. Keep doing that. <laughs> Don't make me so this actually die, predates No More Heroes by like five years, die, I think, right? Die, huh? If I'm not mistaken. <laughs> so, uh, possibly. Oh my god, level five is so expensive. <laughs> anyway, that's fine. Uh, we did level up Mask Smith quite a bit. I'll take care of him. Yeah, actually, he's in. He's in pretty good shape. Um, I'm gonna give him more range though. Okay. What? Can't believe this guy's name is literally just Kevin Smith. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's a totally a different person, but I don't know. Maybe Suda just likes uh the name Travis. Yeah, and the lame sound effect is kind of drowning your dialogue out, man. <laughs> He's whispering. <laughs> All about yeah. <laughs> we 
Could you speak up, please? This fire is very loud for some reason. <laughs> I, know, I know that's like a huge sticking point for some people, where like, when fire makes sound. Did you just say cheese? Am I doing this right? I don't even know. <laughs> Seems like she's winning. She's using the power of cheese against me. Can't believe this. I don't know if there's a particular part of her I should be shooting or what? Just keep shooting her. Hello? Hi. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh no. Oh wait, okay good, we hit her a lot more. <laughs> a lot, a lot more. I think we made the right choice playing as Dan. Yakimo will destroy your country. Back off before you get hurt. Oh my god. Yeah, I can only imagine, right? Because <laughs> he shoots one and has to reload. Holy fuck. Well, shoot, do I play part two? I guess I'll play through part two. We'll do both parts of Sunset tonight. <laughs> oh, this fucking game. Switch to channel one. Oh, I can't. I guess I just leave then. It's a pretty good meme, though, I gotta say. Be like, hey, <laughs> here, try this. It's impossible. We get another anime segment. Garçon's Trailer House. I don't know how all the sounds picking up for this game, but <laughs> the audio balancing is all over the place. I blame the port again. It probably is fine on GameCube. Small place. I used to come here. Quite often, when I was an exchange student, I like this place. Kind of run down, but homey, you know. I didn't come down here to chit chat. I think we've all got. Tell me what I need to know. A spot or two like that okay. in our own hometowns. <clears throat> Let's get down to business. <clears throat> there be a coffee Mr. shop or whatever. A job for you. He wants you to kill <clears throat> this man. His name is Jean de Paul, twenty-three. An apprentice Why do I care how old he is? Fukushima. We could have done it. He's a spy, all right. Damn it. We've seen but him already. He's one of the elite international operatives. Killed quite a few government officials, by the way. Where is he? Try the Kaku. Okay, and? Syndicates from all over the world run their thing in that area. Guess I'll be on my way then. Sayonara. He's very tall. Or this building's small. That's more so the case. <laughs> God. I... I can't say this enough. This game is oozing style. Like... <laughs> it's really cool. Even just like that, that little screen where it's like, we're, okay, we're in Washington, now we're in D.C. Like, boom. 
It's got this cool, like, cubic kind of... It's too late. We won't see any fireworks. For 65 years, we gave everything we had to restoring this country. Hiroyasu, I couldn't read that in time, sorry. <laughs> Paying attention. <laughs> up in smoke once again by the hand of the same country that first put us here. Uh, Shinya Akiba. This is what happens when you rely on boys. That voice now, sounds familiar too. How should we settle this? Shut up, our like in cartoon. Kanjiro Matsukoa. Matsuka. This is exactly the reason I hate young pricks like him. <laughs> oh, they lack patience. Okay, boomer. Hey, kid, do yourself a big favor. Here. Oh no! Blow your head <laughs> off! <laughs> you want to shoot us with that gun? Go ahead. We're prepared to die. Shoot <laughs> us if what it will make you happy. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> but it won't make any difference. Oh, oh. We've done it Please shoot one times. of them. Killing our seniors. But it's how we've always settled things. <laughs> Look at you. Don't even have balls to pull trigger. <laughs> shoot, just shoot I can them. I say this much. <laughs> this boy's got no future. <laughs> it's empty. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh my god, no. He chooses all three. I thought that was a single shot. You know, <clears throat> a real gentleman would dress more appropriately before his death. It's that guy from the first chapter, the zeroth chapter, whatever. Who the hell are you? <laughs> <laughs> Why do they treat elders like we are such nuisances? <laughs> Only if they I love it. How much we truly contribute. I have to agree with you there. He's your eyes. <laughs> <clears throat> so, what do you think, partner? I think <laughs> the fact that like <laughs> skull is ripped back with its brains. <laughs> oh my fucking god! It's too perfect. That you'll always be together. BTJ. Some kind of abbreviation. No idea what the hell that means, but go off, I guess. Aw, oh, knife man, he sucks. <laughs> Sure. I mean, we can switch, whatever, it's fine, but... I guess we've only watched a cutscene, which presumably is skippable. I haven't had to go back yet. <laughs> so maybe, maybe I'm making a mistake, I don't know. It's fine. Or, not making a mistake by saving. <clears throat> oh, I missed. Oh, we got him. I don't think there's any reloading with this guy, which is kind of cool. <laughs> we got him. Oh, I can't switch yet, actually. Hold up. Well, what would happen if I use the TV back there? It probably, it probably would just be static on every channel. Oh, that just goes around. Damn it. Yuaris is there, but he's not going to tell us anything useful. He never fucking does. Stop spawning. Or do. I, I guess or don't. Like, I mean, I'll take infinite XP, I guess. <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> oh yeah? Oh fuck. Oh I fuck. Alright, there we go. <laughs> oh I fuck. Uh oh my G what the fucking hell? Bloody tomato juice. Yeah, that ain't that ain't it. <laughs> we need a password, hold up. God damn it, dude. Ooh. Alrighty, Warzu, what the fuck? Tell me how to do this. This is harsh. Quite harsh, I'd say. We're no longer in tight spark. This is harsh. I can't. I just can't take it. I can't drink it. Not a drop. <clears throat> it tastes as, well, shall I say, heavy. This kind of drink. We got to use an abbreviation for it. Ah, oh, fuck, I'm so dumb. I guess I could have listened to the rest of what he's had to say, but it's on the car. BTJ, CSC, WTS. Okay. Stop. Stop spawning. God damn it. Fucking missed. Alright, we got him. I think I had the right first option, though. Yeah, BTJ, CS... Okay, yeah, well... Uh... What? <laughs> Something changed back here, maybe? Or did I read it wrong? Is it, is it right to left or something? I guess we'll try it the other way. I guess. I don't know. I have no other ideas, so... Fucking... <laughs> oh, wait! Oh my god! There's a whole other... Yeah, BTJ, CSC, W... V... Yeah, WTS. There we go. <laughs> My brain short-circuited that. It's just like, oh, well, it's this thing. Poison smile. Oh, God. Don't poison me. Please. <laughs> Got him. Uh, hallway, hallway, stairs, okay. Well, we got some options, that's for sure. Oh, I almost got him. I'm not sure if that hurts me or not yet. We got some dice. Oh, fuck. Alright, Yoon, what are you gonna say for us? Mr. Smith, I sell information, yes? See through the trick. Copy the kimono woman. The dice are stubborn. Okay. Let's go find the kimono woman. Hey Travis, what's up man? Magnum. <laughs> I need a Magnum Travis for my monster video game. <laughs> this is the information journal central. Where the elites of the world gather, while the back room movers and the shakers stare at each other down. The debate heated up over the subject of the disposal of Japan. <laughs> Why is this game about destroying Japan? <laughs> that little country argued in her favor. <laughs> oh no. The Japanese territory would be a prize to any neighboring country. Excuse me? Neighboring country? Straight up, Japan is on her own. It's a goddamn ocean around it. Fuck do you mean, Travis? Can I switch characters here? Don't make me... Oh yeah, I can. Don't make me say it. Serum Vitality. Oh. Don't make me... <clears throat> Yeah, I can switch.
I really want to get Dan's damage up to max. How much does that cost again? Two big ones and like almost basically almost three of them. <laughs> okay. Regardless, we're, we're we're waking him up. Get the fuck up, Dan. Putting you in. Oh shit, they came back. Which way? No, he's right there! Oh, I thought he was behind me. It's locked by a padlock. Gee, I wonder who I how I can get through this thing. Excuse me? That ain't right. Four? What number is this? That, that's right. There we go. Hey, man. <laughs> I approve of the theremin music going on here. <laughs> we got more guys on our... on our ass. I don't know where, but somewhere. They spawned in. She needs snake eyes. Piercing eyes of Sister Swift. Okay, so snake eyes. What does the map say? Nothing. So I think we just gotta roll till we get snake eyes. Fuck, I missed. Oh, the reload's gonna kill me! Oh, the stomp, though, it saved us. You fucker! Come on, man! Oh my god. This shit right here. Let's see the dice. Roll them. Roll them. You did say something about them being fickle, but I don't know if that's just like... We got it. Doubles rolled. We got it. Give me that hollow bullet soul shell, whatever the fuck it's called. Oh no, don't care. No, not Travis. Fuck off. We want to go to the stairs now. We've done all we can up here, I think. Second floor. Fuck it. We go floor by floor. <laughs> even though surely that is not the way this is arranged. Oh shit, dude. There's so many dudes here. Oh wait, no, that's everyone. Okay. I thought there was like a group to the left as well. This is too easy. It's just weirdly laid out, I guess. Uh what does this thing need? It's another puzzle. <laughs> Looks like we're gonna need a lot of hollow shells to get through this area. Some cards. Okay, well... We're gonna need some clues to figure that shit out. Armin room, can't go wrong. Actually, you can go wrong because now those guys are gonna respawn, probably. Probably not until we go back over there, though, so that's. Okay! A uh, straight flush. Let the cards decide. Nine to king. Right? Of hearts. I'm not even gonna talk to you, you and uh, whatever the hell his name is. Shit! <laughs> Alright, there's this guy in here. 
Well, we can definitely afford to pay that guy some blood if we need to hint, but, uh... I'm thinking we just gotta get a straight flush going here, right? Not yet. Nine... Royal straight flush complete. Oh. We had to outdo him. <laughs> I was just gonna pick 9, 10, 11, 12, or 9, 10, uh, Jack, King, Queen, or Jack, Queen, King, but... Oh, that works too, I guess. Don't you dare fucking poison me. <laughs> I don't know how poison works in this game. Oh, he's still alive! Oh, he poisoned me. My blood. I'm getting out of here. Screw this shit. Keep going up. You know what, Iwarzu, let's see what you got to say. This is a gambler's paradise, alright? I don't think this place cares much for active support. Of crime reduction policies. The hole in the ceiling, that calls for a thief. Jump through it. I'm down. Just leave that job to the persona. Persona! Okay. Actually a, a hint, thanks. Oh god, new guy. Mother Smile. Oh, I see why you're called Mother now. Mother! She's dead. God, the way those guys fall down when you shoot their legs off reminds me of Regenerators in RE4. <laughs> okay, that is where the hollow bullet is, which means the hint is probably over here. If it's anything like the last room I was just in, or the last two rooms, if anything. Travis, what do you guys say? Scorpio! Oh, <laughs> you straight. Proxy owner. Proxy for the owner of Fukushima. The attendees are third rate bureaucrats. And the prey is subpar, so are the assassins. Another fun fact, Japanese version of characters just speak text to speech, but it's all really bad English. That's awesome. What a charade. The US has given up on the talks. Fukushima was the backbone of the UN party. But now the UN party is a toothless organization. Start with the Japan oh. The pink dude said in danger instead of we're in a tight spot. <laughs> Okay, one, four, three, seven, six, two. I can't fucking remember numbers. Hold on. Why do I have no pen here? Okay, we're tabbing out. One, four, three, seven, six, two, five. Oh, tabbing is working much better today for some reason. Yesterday it minimized my whole game, but today it's like whatever. One, four, three, seven, six, two, five. A phrase that went down in history. Don't go in that Harmon room. Oh shit! No! Oh man! I bet I could have got some bonus out of that guy. Also, we can jump to the ceiling here. What do you do? Double! My eyes! <laughs> Oh, I guess I just killed that guy. Hold on, let's go solve the puzzle before I go up there. God, I fucking... I <laughs> suck at aiming sometimes. I don't know. Horse race. And also bathtub. Okay. One. One. Four. Oh, fuck. Hold on. I see. One, four, three, seven, six, two, five. I do like the puzzles in this game. They're good. This one's sim this whole chapter has been pretty simple, but uh, <clears throat> overall, like, pretty good. 
<laughs> I love that we have to watch this. Winner! Correct your race, race prediction. <laughs> Thanks, man. Just a second here. Yes, they garble, garble the text up at least. Winner is you, <laughs> yeah. Well, some vibes of that for sure. Oh, the bathtub is just to get the hint. We got the hint. All right, now we go this way. We switch to Thief Man, which is five, not six, which, which I pushed six because I'm an idiot. Oh, no, four, not five. I don't know what five is. It's not working, though. There we go. This is the guy. Arrival on the fourth floor. Cool. An object. Odd engraving. Okay. Probably need that. <laughs> I'm super digging this game, it's really fun. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Actually, hold on. If I can save in this Harmon room, we'll do it. Oh, that makes sense. Well, I can't save, but you know what? I have a ton of blood, so... Let's just make our already OP character even more OP. Maybe I'll have enough? I think I'll have enough to... It's getting close. I don't think I'll have enough. Like, barely. No, no, we're good. <laughs> ah, alright. Maximum power. Don't make me say it. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, level 5 is actually max power. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't know that. Let's level up his crits while we're at it. Screw it, man. Let's <laughs> make one OP character. <laughs> I could shoot those guys again, I suppose, but let's rather just move on forward here. Don't you... oh. <laughs> Uba. <laughs> no! Oh man, I think I just missed out on a bunch of blood. That's okay, we're already like super OP. <laughs> Something spawning in. I can't aim. Well, he's dead now. He's still alive! He baited us! Oh, we got him though. Uh, I don't know which way I should go. These are probably the answer to this puzzle. I don't know why I went in here. Although there is a save. Let's do it. Uh, Bambi beer. What the fuck that means. Uh, and then red thing. I don't know. Go this way. Where's your weak spot? Uh. Oh, the last second though. Oh, he's still alive! Fuck! <laughs> I forgot. That did a lot of damage, man. It's alright, we can heal. <laughs> Boomerang. Beware of the basement. A hitman is already infiltrated. The swab dude, DePaul. That's our target. <laughs> Who was at the restaurant is a spy from the International Ethics Committee. Their goal is to disrupt the final talks between the US and Japan. We're planning a secret meeting somewhere in this building. 
by interrupting the talks. They hope to delay the sinking of Japan. Take him out, Smith. Take him out. This game's hella weird, man. I walked straight into that. Am I dead? Not dead. Can I see my health? Uh, full health? I guess that was probably a, uh... Whatever type thing. Cards, cards, cards. <laughs> Shoot. Deer, fish, butterfly. Okay, we gotta go back to the posters. I hope those things don't respawn. They probably will. I get it. <laughs> That's the deer. Okay, deer is one. Okay, fish is three. So, deer one, fish three, other thing two. I don't see the symbol on the second one for some reason. Easy every time. The one thing that confused me... Oh, shit. <laughs> uh... Uh... Oh, I know what to do. Either quick guy or invisible guy. So I'm gonna try invisible guy first, unless I pressed the wrong button. I did. <laughs> Wrestling moves won't help us here. I guess you look at the map, it'd probably tell me exactly what to do, but... Trial and error sounds more fun. Never know what hit him. Okay. We ought to have enough for this because I've gotten every goddamn one on the, the area. Hello, gatekeeper. Next, please. Where to? The Vinculum Gate. Let me take those. Yes, all received. He's the same thing every time. Go right on inside. So normally this means the end of the, like, chapter or whatever, so I think we might be reaching the end of, uh, this chapter right on time. It holds its arms wide open. It holds a large sickle. It'll slice you to pieces. I don't know how to open. The same for the sickle. It turned around. Now. Now is your chance. Smash the bright spot. I don't really appreciate that it forces the like strategy of the boss down your throat, but I guess it's okay. Backside smile. What the fuck? Also, this might not be a boss. Dude, I fucking hit it. This is bullshit. Can I leave? Like, is that allowed? <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> nice try, asshole. You cheating fuck. Might be better to use another guy. Maybe the knife guy would be good, because he can... He doesn't need to reload or whatever, you know? Am I dead already? <laughs> okay. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna go to, We're gonna switch to knife guy. That's probably what they want me to do anyway.
That's not knife guy. Three is knife guy. Not four. I'm eventually gonna learn this. <laughs> We get it. Let's go. <laughs> the fuck? We got him. Alright. <laughs> Easy with knife guy. Impossible with anyone else. Got it. Do I have a shit ton of blood again? Oh, no, I totally understand the concept of it. It's just, I kept, like, running out of ammo by the time I flipped them around. And, like, for some reason, my shots weren't registering. They seem to be on point, but I don't know. I guess you guys can't see where my cursor is, so you don't really know where I'm shooting. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I was, like, on target. Alright, now that we've made Dan super OP, let's increase his crit damage as well, <laughs> just so we can make him more OP. <laughs> uh, I'll never learn. Maybe. Well, I've learned enemy slow. Cool. Uh, yeah, we'll just leave it at that. Don't care what Iwarzu has to say, we're gonna go forward. Probably has some useful tips. Or not. It's like 50-50. It's kinda it's kinda fun. Okay. Oh yeah? Well what if I just change to Paede? But I can't though. Damn it. I'm 90% sure that's who I have to use here. But I can't switch to her for some reason. Do it from Harmon's room, then I guess. Don't make me think. Maybe. Oh, she's she's sleeping. That's why. I guess or something. Who the hell knows? No! Oh god! That's not the solution here. Um... Shoot, I guess we'll have to talk to Iwarzu then, because... Can't switch the characters up there, and I don't want to switch to all seven of them and be like, Yo, is this, is this the guy? Is this the guy? Is this the guy? Master, this is harsh. Harsher than hell. Let's knock the target off quick. Shouldn't have to bother with the sushi chef. Use the persona's usual dirty tricks to pulverize him. Bullets won't hit the sushi chef. So listen here, will ya? Do what you have to do. There's no such thing as playing square in this world. Aim for the ceiling. Okay, well that's a tip for the boss fight. How the fuck do I get through this wall? Maybe the luchador? I don't know. Basement, right? It is the luchador. Okay. Six. Let's go. I think we're going down, right? <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, basement right there. There we go. The fuck? It says, it says use him. What the hell, man? Oh my god! Don't do me like this game. We're near the boss. Let me just fight him. Basement. 
That has to be the elevator, and that has to be the guy. Oh, do I just shoot it? Is it that? Is it? Oh, fuck. Oh, man. I'm thinking that's probably what they mean. I'm dumb. I'm really fucking dumb. <laughs> I guess my speech was meaningless. Lucha Libre is for kids. But you know, you are great with the kids, Mask Man. Children are pure. <laughs> what is this they conversation? The strongest. <laughs> oh, we gotta play a sim. I did that right. Fuck you, game. No, stop. Dude, I can't even react to this. Got him. Oh, he just died. The end. <laughs> we got him. Target neutralized. Mahjong room. I don't know how to play Mahjong. Don't do this. Okay, good. They're just playing Mahjong. <laughs> You're taking advantage of us, aren't you? There's more than one scenario, you know. You got this all mixed up, you monkey. Don't you think you can Excuse hold me? on to the bar forever when you're on the verge of death? Listen to him, barking like a stupid dog. Gee, so you finally reveal your... It's Steve Bloom again! He's voicing this guy, too. Or it's the same guy, I don't know. That is a threat to the states. Pong. Oh. It's the one who designs first that wins. Ron him. Someone's gonna get ron I didn't know monkeys could design. Excuse me? <laughs> to make the monkeys. <laughs> yeah, the band. The monkey. Wait, no, that's not a band. The turtles the is a... Bred for fighting. No, the monkeys is a band. Sons of bitches. Right? Do I stop your barking? Ron. Somebody get Ron. That's the only thing I know about Mahjong. Come on. <laughs> oh, Chi is another thing, too, yeah. Don't you care about winning? You really are a stupid dog. You'd better pay attention before someone puts a bullet in your head. Shut up, monkey. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Richie. I guess I know I knew that too. Bad. Like I said, I know your train of thought. But I don't know how to play mahjong. Lawn. lawn. Bullshit. I don't know what lawn is. I never heard that. Traveling. This is pathetic. Hey, yo. Cheater. Wait. That's a forty ten. <laughs> you got no hand. Aren't these guys all American? Shit. <laughs> Why are they all playing Mahjong? <laughs> <laughs> They're all dead now. So it doesn't matter at all. <laughs> oh. Well. That that was their story, I suppose. See you guys. Oh, another ring! In fact, all four of them are cheating. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Hello, Smith. Wave. I finally got some fresh air. That's the air ring, isn't it? Not that I don't like tight places, but there are limits to everything. This place is a bit too tight. A box? It's no threat. I look like a victim of a mutilation murder. Like, slashed into pieces. Pieces? I completely slipped my mind. Maybe I fell into pieces. Families in pieces. Lovers in pieces. Bodies in pieces. My whole life is about pieces. And I figured, why stop now? People I don't care for are also in pieces. Before I knew it, I was all alone. Then I blew up the family to, the facility to pieces. And now there's nobody left. That's when I met him. Daddy Long Legs. Here, I'll give this to you now. It is the wind ring. You're so very kind. He enveloped me in warmth, sending his hand for a gentle caress. And he reached out gently for the grand prize down south. Oh, God. 
Now that really drove me mad. Next moment I'm looking at a pile of minced man, and he knows he deserved it. These baby boomers don't know right from wrong. <laughs> and that's how a killer is born. <laughs> Just fold that back up. See you later. Travis, what do you gotta say? Spice? Spib? They broke down, all according to plan, I guess. What does this fucking shirt say? <laughs> now the sky is right on Japan, that's for sure, but straight up, it doesn't add up. Why doesn't the U.S. destroy the U.N. party? Why do they let them live? Somebody's pulling the strings. Could it be Fukushima adherent? Uh, uh, adherent? Uh, Kenjiro Matsuo, the director of Central... God damn it. Or Matsuken for short. <laughs> Can you pick up where Fukushima left off? Can this dude lead Japan? Is he a bad enough dude to lead Japan? <laughs> That is a nice touch that they're all cheating, though. Oh my god, imagine if I hadn't got that. <laughs> that would have been so annoying. Uh... No, I wanna... No, no, no. I can't unlock the B1 floor. Oh, okay, I see. It's one or the other. Oh, yeah? Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. Alright, whatever, man. Oh, I can switch. Hell yeah. Oh, fuck! You're still alive! You're just more of you! Oh, I'm dead. He's probably a shadow now, right? Pro wrestlers sure are awesome. <laughs> Reminds me of my childhood. We'd watch wrestlers fighting on the TV. I just loved Master Smith. Have you ever considered returning to the ring? Prove the ultimate art of fighting is professional wrestling. A Veil Tudo match. Matsuken has the Yakumo. He wants to change the world. He believes that Japan will arise from the ashes. The war won't end until you kill him. When you finally meet Matsuken, you can end... You can... This can all end. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Oh my god, there's more! A heal. That didn't work! Ooh. Holy shit. Okay, take me to the roof. I have a dream. When I grow up, I'm gonna become the president. I'll make the world a place with no bad people. I promise you. Kill every last scum. It'll be a peaceful place. And nobody can stop me. Why did we kill this guy? <laughs> but you know what? There are two people who keep screwing things up. The old man just won't die. Get to smash his brains to finally kill him for good. Big old man, your tie is crooked. Holy damn. Alright, clearly this has to be the end of the chapter, right? Like, we've been here for a minute. And we're at the roof now. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Simple enough. Oh my god, dude. I guess I can just go forward. I don't need to stop and fight this guy. This is too easy. Roof and meeting room. Okay. Meeting room, what's up? Oh, shit. What do I need? Oh, the ring. Okay. Well, I can save over here, so hold on. Of course, I gotta go fight my way through all these dudes. I see you back there. Winged beast. I just got a shitload of gold, or not gold, uh, <laughs> blood from that. I think the bird gave that to me. I don't know what else would have. I'm not talking to you while I was. Oh, there's even more stuff I can go to over there. It's nutty. 
Thank the blood. What? Oh, I stopped it. I didn't know I could do that. Oh, no, it stopped itself. No! <laughs> it's closed. <laughs> no! <laughs> you fucking assholes. This is a frick-ass game. <laughs> Whatever, I came in here to save anyway. I didn't really care about the blood. Hope that's available later. Though I don't super care that much. Oh, Travis is over here. Rainbow. Nice work, Chief. Have you had your fill of picking off the small fries? Well, the big fish are still fair game. The UN Party Headquarters is right over there. Your target is a, corrupt, a couple of corrupt old men. The incarnation of greed. Straight up, they're sly old foxes. Japan's good as shit. The ring opens up the door to battle. Go finish him off, Smith. <clears throat> Hello? Oh. We in there. Oh boy. We ain't quite in there yet, but uh... We're getting there. <laughs> Alright. Into the meeting room. The wind ring howls. Oh. Just these guys. You're already dead. It's big. It's too big. Our voices will never be heard. You really think you're better than us because we're old men. <laughs> Never you said that. Getting out of here alive. <laughs> not going down just yet. Not without a fight. <laughs> we'll show him. Why are, why are we like effectively fighting Japan in this game? <laughs> It's a nice touch with the flowers there. I think I'm doing this right. It's not hurting them though, so I don't know. Maybe I'm not doing it right. Hmm. It's over here. Do I just shoot all the, the flowers? Maybe. Ah, there we go. We're onto something. I'm gonna get hit any second now. Shoot this. Probably should have talked to what's his name in retrospect, but that's okay. Maybe I need to use someone else, I don't know. It's either that or I need to hit them while they're doing that. Like maybe their brain's exposed for a second, I can shoot that. <sighs> it's not working though. <laughs> I 
that does seem right though, like wait for them to cough and then they can hit their brains. Especially because of the way that guy leans forward on the left there. Now look at their hands. Sure, I understand. <laughs> so pointing outwards and pointing that way, or whatever, but. What does that mean? Shit. If I zoom in on their hands. Oh cool, I can switch characters, cool. Alright. Katie, look at their hands. Closely. I still don't get it. <laughs> Probably should have talked to what's his name. <laughs> that was a big mistake. That did something, I think. Oh, no, no, no. Don't help him fix his tie. On to something here. Shit. I just don't know. I don't suppose I can leave and come back in, right? <laughs> Can I get the reverse to happen? Like if I hit this guy a bunch? Hmm. Seems to be no, not at all. Dude, I am super lost right now. I'm gonna confirm I can't leave, right? Okay, I can't. <laughs> Shoot. isn't the ideal guy to fight these guys with. <laughs> Let's be real. I didn't mean to press four. Uh, meant to press three. I. You know what? I'm cheating. No, 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 no. Uh, that pauses right. I guess. This guy's not level up as all. Well. Sunset Part 2.
Constantly throw brains at you across the room. This is their only means of attack. Either shoot their brains or simply run from them and avoid taking damage. First of all, you must use Coyote for this. Oh, okay, you must use Coyote. Shoot the flowers, okay. Now scope of the two men, shoot. Guy on the right. Be a good pal and straighten his friend's ties. This will expose the back of his head. I was shooting that! Are you fucking kidding me? Hold on. As far as I've read, but it sounds like that's the strat. Hold on. God damn, dude. This motherfucker's tie is indestructible. Okay. <laughs> sure, why not? Spring coming at me. Shit. Okay, hold on. Reload. I was wondering why they were just standing there. Oh shit, he's shooting more now. I don't do that. He's dead, I hope. <laughs> Alright, what are you gonna do when I when you don't have your friend to fix your tie, eh? Yeah! Okay, he's leaning his over. Okay. I fucking missed it. God damn it. It's a very silly way to fill finish this boss off, I suppose, but, uh, it's also funny, given that they're, like, you know, corrupt businessmen or whatever. Oh, shoot! He doesn't just do that- he just does that randomly, I don't need to shoot him at all. I think, anyway, right? We get him? We got him. GG's. <laughs> I swear I shot that spot though. <laughs> well, he was fixing the tie. I just, I, I guess I missed. I, but I must have missed. But I was aiming for it. Alright. Back in suburb Seattle. At an overpass somewhere. What can you do when the whole world has its eyes on you? Almost everything. Destroying one or two nations? <laughs> it's an easy task here. The promise made 30 years ago wasn't a guarantee. It was only the beginning of a countdown. Look at them. They're heading toward hell. What's sad is that we've gotten used to this. I mean, our senses. That's pathetic. That doesn't necessarily mean that we're not human. Okay, now you're not helping. Alright, that's sunset. I'm going to call it here, I think. We'll go ahead and uh, pick this up tomorrow. I'm going to start Paper Mario first. Uh, we'll play that for a bit. I think I'll just split them halfway, because we're not going to finish this tomorrow. We're not going to finish Paper Mario tomorrow for sure. Uh, so two hours in, we'll switch from Paper Mario to this. and It'll be a good old fun stream. Two, two great games back to back. But yeah. We'll be back at 8 p.m. Eastern tomorrow. Continuing my N64 marathon and then picking this back up. It's a solid game. So that's chapter 2 out of 7.
seems like most of these are split into two parts, so I think we'll probably just play through one of these a day, so it'll take like seven streams to get through all of it. Whatever. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> but, solid game though. Till then, thanks everybody for watching. I'll see y'all later. Take care, have a good night, etc, etc.